These Boeing 737 MAX 9 jetliners aren't leaving the ground. The FAA ordered 171 of the planes pulled out of service, forcing hundreds of cancellations for Alaska Airlines and United Monday, while investigators try to determine what caused a door panel to blow out during an Alaska Airlines flight Friday night. Alaska. It happened at about 16,000 feet shortly after taking off from Portland, leaving a gaping hole in the aircraft. The force was so great it pulled off a passenger's shirt and ripped open the locked fortified cockpit door 26 rows away. Nicholas Hoke was on the flight. A loud boom or almost like a mini explosion um, happens abruptly. The so-called plug door was recovered in a school teacher's backyard. The panel is put in place of an optional emergency exit on some 737s. When they install it, it is really not something that becomes an inspection item from the inside of the airplane. You really cannot even tell that there is anything different about that location. Investigators will spend another day pouring over the airplane. You can see it back behind us here with particular focus on that area where the 63 pound piece of the airplane blew out. On three separate occasions in the last month, pilots flying the week's old plane reported pressurization warning lights, including on January 4th, the day before the incident. Alaska then restricted the airplane to fly only over land while it tried to troubleshoot the problem. They'll be looking at the totality of the circumstances to see why this happened. Boeing is planning a safety summit on Tuesday. Chris Van Cleve, CBS News, Portland.